Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We're jumping in again. I've just been for a lovely lunch with some friends. I was talking about it in the previous episode. That is on the same day. And I'm going to play as... I don't know. Who am I going to play as? Who am I going to play as? Hmm. Hmm. I still want to do lost stuff. I've been playing lost a lot recently, but I don't know. People seem to like the lost episodes, I hope. I hope. Um, so let's play as Lost again. I think it's just a fun character. Lo I'd say Lost and Tainted Lost are two of my favourite characters. In fact, I'd say Lost, Tainted Lost, and Keeper and Tainted Keeper are my four like favourite characters. I think they're all a lot of fun. Um, and compared to how they used to be on the initial conception, it's kind of crazy how far they've come. Considering. But either way, we are jumping in. Uh, we're seeing what we get here. Nightshade is perfection itself. I'd love to duplicate it there, but I don't think there's any way I'm going to get 35 cent here. Uh, also, by the way, something that I haven't done in quite some time, and I realise some of you may be um, wondering what's going on slash waiting for it to happen again, but I haven't uh, played as some of the other modded characters we used to have on the streak in a while. I initially disabled them sort of temporarily um, while we were dealing with some lag issues, and the lag issues have since been solved, and I haven't really made my way back round to them. Um... So I do apologise about that, and I will have a session soon where I'll reinstall some of them and play through them again. Mainly I want to do another um, deleted streak sort of thing, um, if you guys would be down for that. Um, I, before I did like, where I played as all the versions of the deleted in a row. Would you guys want to see that again, or would you rather just see deleted mixed in here and there? Because I know some people aren't a fan of deleted, but other people really are. And then there's like, Arachna who we could play as. I haven't played as the Tarnished characters in a little while either. Um, th there's definitely a few that are on my, on my radar of the characters I haven't played in a little while. I'll be honest, the, um, the Tarnished characters, um, although they are like, fun, they're not characters that I want to play often. Um... Just because they're not... Some of them aren't really my sort of style in terms of their design and stuff. Um, and yeah, like Arachna. I, I would like to play with Arachna on because she has some unlocks and stuff. But just the mod adds too much leg, sadly. It's very sad times. Very sad times. Okay, it's good that you're swallowing these balls because that'll give me uh, little wispy wispies to kill you with slash protect me. The more you spawn, the stronger I become. You get these little homing shots that I think only deal about 10% of that damage. It's very, very low damage. But it's more about the protection it yields us. Um, the fact that th these little wisps can block shots is very, very nice. Very, very nice indeed. And we do get something rather nice there with a little bit of damage up. Um, and we'll go down. By the way, does anyone know why that happens? That thing said 0.5 damage for the item on the tooltip, the EID. But I gained 0.93, and I see that happen a lot with tier rate and damage, where the stats that it says it's going to give you aren't accurate. And I understand it when you have multipliers, but I don't believe Lost has any multiplier to damage. So I'm curious as to why sometimes it does that. Is it just that it's weighted based on, like, if your damage is currently low then it will give you more damage, whereas if it's higher, it'll give you less. I'm, I'm guessing that's what it is, but I don't actually know. Just running out the clock here. I don't want to go into a room while I have whiz shot, I'll be honest. Running out the clock. Uh, we, we want to try and do delirium. Um, we want to do greed mode, which obviously we can't do right now. We want to do beast. Beast is looking like the one to go for at the moment. We did have one where we were going to do delirium recently, but... We got blasted on Hush. It was truly a sad time. Come on, Ayo Wizard. It's been a while now. It's getting a bit ridiculous. Here you go. It's over, it's over. You see what I mean about these wisps of protecting us here? Extra key, very nice. As for the question of the day today, um, what's a food you don't think enough people have given a chance? Ah! Take the spider out before it kills me. Fool uh, drops... Oh, Fool's kind of interesting. I'll keep the Fool on me. Because I can... I'm pretty sure I can drop my bombs and uh, money as like the quarter and stuff. And if I do that, I can then re-roll them. Which seems tempting. Especially bombs. Imagine getting Pyro, then using Fool and re-rolling them all. 
That'd be pretty entertaining. That would be pretty spicy. But I'm, I'm, in a, I'm in a good mood for Isaac at the moment. I really am. I'm in a good mood for Isaac. I'm enjoying playing the vanilla characters. I know that you guys do want to see the modded characters sprinkled in here and there. And I am trying to do that. Did that last episode. Um, and it'd be nice to just see requests for what people want to see. So I know sort of what characters to try and prioritize. Obviously, there is going to always be a delay because I record with a bit of a backlog. But still, Dead Tooth. Yeah, not that, not that bothered. I knew that that 25% chance would not be in our favor, but I had to try for the reroll anyways, because Dead Tooth is next to valueless as this character. Like, let's be honest. Let's be honest. How much value am I actually going to get out of that? Let's be careful. Bombs are key. Not ideal. I'd rather have two keys, to be honest, but hey her, let's go. Right. Let's just skedaddle, skadoodle out of this floor, I think. This guy's not too bad, especially because he spawns things that are going to increase our wisp count drastically. The more wisps we have, the more wisps we gain. I think this is our maximum, though. But you can see how much extra damage we're getting from this item. It's pretty good. Eight balls, obviously not very good. We'll try and re-roll that. I'll take Guppy's eye. Yeah, that's decent enough. Um, damn it, I keep forgetting I need to do Mega Satan. <laughs> I keep forgetting I need to do Mega Satan as this character. Let's try and do the Beast this time then, I guess. Let's just try and do the Beast. Oh, I get a, I get a kill for knocking him over. Kind of interesting. Right, game, please don't screw me with the keys again like you did last episode. No hot bombs for me, thank you. Oh, this guy's going to be an absolute pain. The way that he moves is just so frustrating. I mean, he got a, a secret room open for us, though. That's always nice. Stop moving like a dick. He just moves like sort of jitters back and forth. It's really, really difficult to predict. Beautiful stuff. There's a key and some extra bombs as well. I won't use a key on that yet, because we know we're not going to get a key back. But if I get more keys, then I probably will. Just because it could open a few times and give us some good stuff. Hey, there's another key. Let's try for one more still. What do you guys do when you're charged up? Oh, you're just very fast, I see. That's kind of interesting. There's a third key. Okay, I'm happy now. I got three keys. And next thing is going to be an item already. Not the item I was expecting, but um, Inner Child is a revive. That's pretty nice. Um... Probably worth it for the crawl space, right? If we get one. We did. Okay. Check what's going on down here. Yeah. Pretty interesting. I'll take it. Not had this item uh, in a long time. We fire a lot slower, but tears burst into five shots. It seems pretty good. I think the tears, if their if their teeth do three times damage, still, we do, we are gonna need some uh, some tears up pretty rapid. But this is a pretty interesting item that can lend itself to be quite strong. Bunch of cards there. Don't think I'll need those right now. But yeah, basically this is kind of like um, mass shotgun from Enter the Gungeon. If you're like just at the right distance away, it'll uh, do a lot of extra damage. It's also just got some good AoE to it as well, which is nice. And then in here we've got Mended Knife, which I think I will take. Mended Knife is actually pretty decent. Not worth risking the reroll for, I don't think. Mended Knife is literally just the, the knife for, that you get. Um, very good. Yeah, it's just the knife that you get for doing the Mother Path, but it's one that you just get to use and keep as a familiar. It's a pretty basic idea for a familiar, really, but it works. Do not like the situation I'm in right now. 
I can't remember exactly what Crutch does. Tears um, with chance base effects gain Herming a significant size increase. Okay. We still need a chance base effect to go along with this for it to work. Tarot cloth seems good. Drops Isaac's most recent six items alongside uh, the pickups. Oh, okay. Okay. Could do some mass re-rolling, but I think honestly our items that we have right now we don't we don't want to drop, right? I don't think so. Extra bombs is lovely. Kill with my teeth. Um, I think this uh, this with spectral is is pretty good too. I'm liking that. Not doing one bomb for two pennies. Thank you very much. Don't think that's a great trade. Come on now, give us some tears up game. You know you want to. Dude, the tinted rocks are kind of wild right now. That was very nearly a death. Very nearly a death. Oh boy. Um. I guess this is worth it. Right, I think we're good to go. We do have rocks here, but rocks don't do much against a guy that can just break straight through them. Careful with the falling rocks. Okay, he's pretty much dead now. Good stuff. Little bit risky on that guy. We got there. Probably want to just take perfection at this point. Luck based effects. Yeah, probably just want to take perfection. Right, um. Sorry, Crutch. You're very good, but. Not for me today, thank you. Not for me today. We did get a tier rate increase. Wasn't obviously a lot, but. Have I been missing care for him so far? Doubt that counts as having a guppy item, but thought I'd check just in case. At least we've got these Nightshade Wisps to augment our, um, our fire rate a little bit. Oh, dude. That's a big old infested. Okay. We got Yumheart there. Gave it a reroll. My, my reroll chances on uh, this version of Lost are just abysmal. I constantly fail them. It is what it is, but it is, it is a little frustrating to see. But anyways, uh, aside from the game today, how have you guys all been? Tell me about your day. I've been, I've been feeling pretty good recently. I've been, I've still been a little annoyed over the past few weeks with my, my leg healing. But I went to physio the other day and it was... It was pretty good. Someone was saying in the comments that in America, my physio appointment was like 70 pounds. They were saying in America that I'd be like a couple of grand or more. It's like fucking... What the, that chest had nothing in it. Country's goddamn broken. One empty heart container. We have to re-roll this, aren't we? Okay. As <clears throat> Adrenaline's literally useless, but it does get us closer to spun. I don't think it's worth grabbing though. Even though I know I'm just going to lose it. I think it's worth re-rolling. Unfortunately, that's also worth re-rolling. doesn't do anything for us. Items so far not been super hot for us. Hitting enemy in the back. Okay, yeah, we'll definitely take that. Thank you. The map would be pretty decent here. I'll take that. Thank you for my treasure map. I'm liking our setup we got going on now. This is actually performing pretty darn well. But yeah, it was, it was annoying with my knee. And it, it, it just kind of was what it was. What the hell hit me then? Uh, it just kind of was what it was, I guess. Like, I can't I can't be too mad. It just... But it's just annoying to, like... I got really into running and then life just stopped me. Abruptly stopped. Pretty good. More tears up. Good stuff. Right, let's head back. Get some more charges. One second. Right, let's keep it going. Yeah, let's go back and get a charge. 
But yeah, I'm appreciative that I got to have the physio, and it does seem to be working. It's just still taking a while to heal, and I really, I really want to get out running again. I really, really enjoyed it. I was really getting into it, and I was losing loads of weight, and it, I felt accomplished. Life just takes it away from me. Um, ooh, a miser heart. Hello. I don't even know if miser hearts would do anything for us right now. I don't even know if that's helpful for us. Don't explode on me, please. We do have a boss trap room here. Ooh, which is another tears up. I think I have to take this. Yes, that was an absolutely ginormous tears up. This backstab that I got here, very good reroll. I don't really know where I got that from, but I'll accept it. Dark boy here. Got him bleeding again, that's good. Oh, when, when he puts the darkness up, he um, gives us piercing. Pretty funny. Good stuff, baby, good stuff. Very, very good. Very, very nice. Right, we also have a charge ready as well now. Um, one more go item room here. We'll see what we get. Honestly, having gotten Backstabber out of this, I'm pretty happy. Dude, that, that shot speed increase is pretty bonkers. I don't know if that's a good thing for us or not. It still seems to split at the same distance, though. <sighs> Magneto. Not, not the best, but we're not going to get much else out unless there's a battery in the slide I didn't see. Right. Keep it going. Keep it running. Yeah, I don't know if anyone else has got into that recently, where it's like you've got into a hobby and you've got really into it, then you've abruptly had to stop for a really long time. It's just frustrating. I don't know why I'm getting these. It must be from Backstabber. Yeah, it must be from Backstab damage, killing stuff. It's kind of nice, though, being able to get this extra bit of damage that is around for a little while. Yeah, yeah, there you go, look. Dude, this is kind of ace. Holy shit, I can't believe that guy didn't hit me there. These wisps are just saving my life right now. Oh god. Get out of here, chuckle nuts. Okie dokie. Pretty happy with the two items we just got. Constellation Prize, I think, was another fire rate increase. Either that was damage. It might have been damage, actually. Good. Um, and then extra damage against bosses. 30% extra damage against bosses and champions is pretty nice. I can't actually, I still can't actually tell. Is it splitting further away from me because of my shot speed? I think it might be. Makes things slightly harder. Yeah, it definitely is. Damn you, high shot speed. It makes it very hard to get the split in the right position to uh, deal maximum damage. At least we've got our wisps to take care of things, though, and we miss with our split. What we need is piercing. Of course, we get a black heart, and we don't really need it. Thank you, nonetheless, for the game. Thank you, nonetheless. Yes. Yeah, I'm, I'm sort of warming up to use my Fool card. Don't know when to use it, but I'm getting ready for it. Keep on. Just go to every room at the minute. Beautiful stuff. Getting more of these. They just keep coming. Obviously, the damage does fade away pretty quick. It's not, like, amazing, but it's extra damage nonetheless. We get a few drops in a row like this. It's nice to have. There's that item room at least. What do you hold for us? Dude, this game, man. 
Another failed reroll. It's only a 25% chance to fail, you know? <laughs> My luck with this is just so bad. Yeah, the thing is, it's like almost half the room's length that it splits at. Like that. At least we're getting a lot of room drops from uh, perfection. That's always nice to see. Another one of those. Just annoying that we have this full card that we have to keep picking back up every time. Waste a little bit of time. Every time we have to do it. We've got to wait around. We can't just pick it up and use it on the go. Wait until we're in the next room to use it. it would be ideal. Oh, dude. The damage this does the... The damage this does is divine. I love it. Secret room? Nah. Thought it might be right there. I'm not going to piss around trying to find it. You want to die, boy? You want to die? No? Don't want to die. There you go. And you give me some blood as well. Love you. Thank you. Right. Time for you to meet your grizzly end, good sir. Okay, that was unexpected, and that could easily happen again. Thank God it didn't. Extra bit of damage, extra bit of range. Is the range good for me? I don't know. Do I want to go for a reroll here? Or do I just want to take the meager tears up? I think I'm going to reroll. Void bombs are pretty damn good, I'll take them. Right, are we good to go? I think we are good to go. Right, we're go we're gonna go thingy floor. Remember, we're gonna go to the beast. Do I really want extra shot speed? Heck it, why not? We're in this now. It doesn't seem to affect... It's, it's hard to tell. Oh, God. This is going to be rough. Especially considering I can't get it to split. That didn't work the way I wanted it to. Oh, no, it did. Oh, my God, that was scary. That was a bit rough. It seems to still split at the same distance, to be honest. Right, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I'm going to leave my Fool card... here. Just so I don't have to piss around with picking it back up and then come back and use it when I need it. Cool. I kind of forgot about the way that these guys work. Yeah, that now these I can just be like, boom, mine. Wait on it. Pop it in the next room. Get full use out of it. I'm curious. Hmm. We'll see how this goes, I guess. It seems pretty good. It seems like it'd be better with piercing. It seems pretty good. BFF doesn't do much for us. I want to get up to 75 cent before I buy that. No, 65. Yeah, 65 is fine. Flat tears up is nice. Okay, good, good, good. Take our blood and carry on our way. I kind of like my reflection here. It's weird. 
Don't know how it'll change with different shot speed, though. Wasn't expecting a boss here. Good. Try to get as much stuff as I can so that full card is worth more. The thing is, it could obviously just fail and I re-roll stuff into nothing. But i got to try these things. None of that, thank you. So much extra blood. Keep it coming. Don't know what happened with that guy. Couldn't tell you. Damage on this seems to be amazing. With my reflection, at least. Right, we've got to look for our full card, which I failed to look for. Failed to pay attention to. My bad. There it is. Right. Up we go here. We go into the boss, yes. But this is going to be kind of hard to use our tooth on. Optimally, at least. Stand here, I think. It's kind of working. Okay, good. We got it. Take whichever one we want. Full card out. Right, grab this, use it, see what happens. So we want, obviously, that back. We want... <sighs> I think we want that. I think my reflection was pretty good. I think we want that. And I think we want void bombs again. And the rest we re-roll and see what we get. Fucking trash garbage bullshit. <laughs> oh my god. This is awful. I mean, Canes of the Rye is decent. The rest of that is garbage. Wow, it's such garbage. Holy hell. Alright, I'm going to go look for a, a, a battery charge here because I am incredibly displeased with that. There's no battery charge, and I can't even afford one even if there was. Dude, that is so horrible. <laughs> oh, that was not really worth it at all. Tears have a knockback, but also you get knocked back upon firing. I can't take that. Cast Dicey is literally useless. These two are somewhat okay. These are useless. I should have left this so that I could have used it to uh, gain charges back, but yeah. Unfortunate. Did not go my way. Luckily, the items that I did lose weren't ones that I particularly needed. One second. I've right, got a boss trap room here if we want to do it. Not currently, I don't. Don't care for the extra keys, to be honest. It's my reflection my like he's going to get me killed, isn't it? <laughs> Gulp? Nah. I can spin it down into something, maybe. I think I did that wrong. Useless there, sadly. I just want a penny. Give me a singular penny and I'll be happy. No pennies. Where... Come on, game. Where they at? 
Getting a lot of blood. No pennies. Alrighty then. Didn't even get a chance to fire. This is crazy. How have I not a single penny yet? There you go. Check what this is. Generate up to four additional rooms each floor. Rooms can be normal or special. Yeah, why not? Right. Let's go spin down gulp. Um water bottle, whatever it's called, and see what we end up getting. I really don't know what it's going to spin down into, but it could be good. You never know. It could be trash. You also never know. <gasps> it's very good. The lower health enemies get, the more knockback we do to them. Oh, dude. Bad hit there. I honestly might die here. I don't remember what this guy does. Yeah, it's okay. We got an extra life, but we don't have a thingy currently. This knockback is really making this difficult, actually. So it's kind of more knock forward than it is knock back. So we lost that extra life there, but well, at least we had an extra life. Yeah, the knock back is kind of also knock forward. <laughs> We are also a teeny tiny little wee little baby boy now, so that could be helpful, I guess. Yeah, because basically if the tears pass by and then hit them on the way back, they knock the enemies into us. Wow. That was close. Do you want to fuck off back that way? <laughs> oh, fucking, I hate these d douches. Justice. Get out of here, saw blades. Didn't nobody ask for you. Okay. We'll see how this goes. I'm not particularly hopeful with this knockback, you know, because the damage is nice, but feels like it's going to cause me some, some real trouble with knocking enemies into myself. It's funny, at least. We're blasting through at least here. I wonder if these four additional rooms that I got from this Atlas item affect this. Yeah, no. Ain't no way I'm doing this bullshit. Those crows are really annoying. We're really heckin' annoying. Up we go. Opa. Yeah, these guys are brimstony. Also a bit of a nightmare to knock around things that are firing brimstone. Don't really like moving those guys, but... I don't have much choice, baby. I just have to go with the floor. It is kind of funny, and, and it is kind of nice to get that extra back damage when we miss, but... Tis also a wee bit scary. Oh, look at that. <laughs> How am I to predict if that guy's going to hit me when they're moving like that? Oh, God. I wish I could stack these bloods and just save a bunch of them for the boss and have, like, really fast decaying, but really high damage. Because the higher it is, the faster it decays. It's pretty funny. We're getting a lot of them though, so it's stacking up. 
We're plowing through this at the moment. Things aren't going too poorly. But who's to say that couldn't change very rapidly. I'm liking bleeding stuff as well. Hitting stuff in the back is very, very easy with my reflection here. Okay, this is going to be kind of a nightmare. Okay, luckily we got through that scot-free. Dude, we do, we do kill stuff really fast. I'm really hoping that also applies to the bosses that we'll be coming up against. But for some reason, I don't think it will. Well, this is a very long wrong way. I don't think I've ever gone a wrong way that far before when going through the uh, ascent. My bad. But yeah, I like runs like this. This this milk teeth item, I feel like I've just not really seen it before. Like, I've had it as part of, I think it's pride pin that you normally get it as part of. But I've never, I don't think I've actually ever had a run with this as the item. It's pretty cool. Like, it's, it's so crazy how I can play modded for this long and still come across, um, like, items like this that I've either haven't or very rarely seen. It's weird. Thank God. I think I can get extra life again if I, uh, oh my God. The kind of funny room this. Not hard or anything. We don't even care about a charge, really, but... Sacrificial blood. I love the fact that they got the official guy to voice act those. Such a great little tweak to them. Oh, really? You had to actually spawn one of these little fucks? Ah, <sighs> what do you think of mushrooms? Are you a mush Are you guys a mushroom fan? I really like mushrooms. I know a lot. Like, I, f I feel like they're, they're a, devi a divisive bit of food. I feel like mushrooms and peppers are like two big ones. I've recently got more into peppers. Which is good, because they're like, in everything. So much food that's peppers in it, and I, just, I never used to be a big fan of it. But as I've eaten more chili, chilies are technically peppers, they've got that peppery taste to some hot sauces, I've become more accustomed to the taste, and I'm starting to enjoy it more. So like, when I have like, a fajita, like at a restaurant or something that has ch ch um, peppers on it, normally I just remove them, but now I've, I've started leaving them in. But yeah, mushrooms is a really divisive one, I really like mushrooms, but a lot of people don't like them for the texture more than, more than the taste. And I can kind of see that. I can kind of get it, but they're just so nice. They work in so many things as well. How are you meant to have a fry up breakfast without mushrooms? God damn. Got a D100 there if we want to uh, take the risk. This guy is an absolute pain in the ass. Dude, look at this. It just pulled him right towards me. Give me that back. It's sucking that heart towards me and I can't even pick it up. Come on, fella. Some of these guys, my god. They're taking their sweet ass time to die. Probably won't get too many of these when it comes to beast fight time, so... Eat them while we can. Oh, this guy's a pain. Fires up ghosties, right? Ghosties that come after me. There you go. They came after me, but they could not keep up. I love it when that happens. Dude, more bombs, honestly. Yes, please. Our void bombs are going to do some crazy good damage. Against the beast himself. Right, last floor. Last floor, baby. More sacrificial blood, thank you. Oh, God. I forget what this guy does. Either way, he's dead. That was a very quick kill. Oh, shit. I keep forgetting that the lost fly that hovers around the edge of the room attracts enemies. Did you see that um, Mega Fighter just jumped on it trying to hit it? Like it is with Punching Bag. Really useful, that. Right, we are here. We are good to go. We have returned. 
Thank you, I guess. No spicy key. Do not want you. Sometimes I'm firing two shots, right? Oh, it's Kane's eye doing it. Okay. Why does this not give you inner child anymore? Is that a thing they removed? I swear it used to give you inner child. Every time. Maybe it's because I've already had inner child. Good mum item. Hair throw. <laughs> Doesn't do much for us. Right. What? Where dog more at? <laughs> TV with no dogma. What's happening here? <laughs> What's going to happen in the second phase? Is there going to be a second phase? I'm confused. <laughs> um... What? <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> I, I'm stuck in this room. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Stage... Is it like 13 or something? 13... Yeah. Right, let's try this again, shall we? <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> Wait a minute, I need to not skip the, the cutscene here. One second. <laughs> What's killing him? I got bed bug, yay! Okay, don't know why it was doing that, but we fixed it. That was pretty strange. Yeah. Oh my god. Don't do spinnies. I always say it and he always does it the moment I say I don't do it. The knockback is getting a bit ridiculous, but the damage we're doing is pretty high. There you go. Well, that was weird. <laughs> Just d a fight with no dogma. Just TV. <laughs> Good thing here is basically we can't miss. Whenever we miss with our tooth, we've always got shots flinging about the place that are going to end up hitting him at some point. Bad thing about this is obviously we are prone to dying very easily just by getting hit even once. And our shots are all red, which makes things a visibility a little bit of a struggle here and there. Good thing is we've got a lot of wisps around us from killing various things. I, don't, I honestly don't know what, technically, that we've killed, but game says we've killed something, so what even just happened there? Blood. I didn't even think about the fact I'd be able to get blood in this fight, but we got some blood. More blood. Don't, don't, don't hurt yourself to get the blood. It's not worth it.
Okay, things are going well. My reflection in this fight is really going quite wild. I love it. So this is, this is the sort of thing that I love. Like, this on a, on a run with all our other mods on would be lagging like goddamn crazy. And we're able to avoid most of the lag with the setup. Much better. Makes me smile. That was close because he almost charged right into me there. Ah, oh, fucking bugger. There was a fire in the way. I lost my holy mantle. This isn't good because uh, this guy with the sides hits me quite, quite frequently, I'd say. Bomb? Don't even know where it went. I am able to knock back these skulls, which is not a good thing. We're getting a little stacked up there. Right. Not that this is a guarantee, but the beast is the easier of the three if the fight goes quickly, which I think with that damage it should. Especially once we get bleeding on him. Which I'm hoping we get pretty quickly. Bombs are doing a good job as well. We're unable to hit him at the minute, which is kind of annoying. Don't do this to me. Dude, no. That was so close. He put the last fire so low down. We're out of bombs now. I really thought he completely fucked me there. Right. Just keep it low and slow here. I've got a phone call coming in, but I can't answer it right now. Right. There you go. I hope you guys did enjoy that one, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.